It was really scary as, as a first time parent and witnessing you know, a seizure in a normally healthy little girl. It was, it was terrifying. And she was having 30 to 40 seizures a day. She was having so many seizures. She was, she was missing out on all the things that little girls her age should be doing. Since we didn't have a cure or a solution at that time, it was kind of like, this is going to be your lifestyle. Like this is how you're going to live. And I mean, it was it was a roller coaster. And that's epilepsy. It's so unpredictable. We said all along. There has to be a better life for her. There has to be something else that we can do. The neurology is the localization. A tiny part of the brain controls the big part of the body. Phase one evaluation where you bring into the epilepsy monitoring like this, all these testings, which are done only in the level four epilepsy center like Nationwide Children's Hospital, to find out the candidacy of their epilepsy surgery. When we found out that she was a candidate for her epilepsy surgery, it was like a weight has been lifted off. You know, somebody, somebody found something that we can do. Until that point, we really felt lost. They told us up front, they said, look, you know, there could be serious complications. And as a parent, to have to make the choice, you know, do you live with her struggling or do you live with, you know, more disabilities? It's a lot to process. What Haley had is the two-stage surgery we call intracranial monitoring where you open the brain, put the EEG leads on the brain and map the seizures. As with most uh, cases in surgery, every patient's a little bit different. For patients like Haley, we can conduct further monitoring with intracranial electrodes. We can map out the eloquent portions of the brain to avoid them in a potential resection. And I remember seeing her for the first time after surgery and she just looked like a little angel. We didn't think that she would be able to move her left side at all because the, the area of her brain that the seizures are coming from controls the motor function of the left side. And she looked at me and I, I just, I asked her, I said, you know, can you move your arm? Good girl, let's do it again, one more time. I had no words. It was amazing. Through everything we've been through right now, we're seizure free. And she's just so happy. She's such a happy little girl. It was Haley's first day of kindergarten. I got excited and I was happy, so I, I figured I'd call Dr. Gadella. I just wanted to leave this message for Dr. Gadella. Um, I just wanted him to know that Haley started kindergarten today and she demanded to ride the bus. And we are just really thankful for everything that you guys did for us. He saved her life. Um, she wouldn't have got on that bus if it wasn't for him. And I needed, I needed to tell him that.